Good afternoon, everyone. Um, welcome to this event. I'm happy to be here. Uh, first of all, let me welcome all of you. Welcome also Member of Parliament, uh, Mr. Shannon Brownbill, and uh, of course the persons who are here uh, for the main event who have participated. Uh, my name is Lois Brown. I am the Secretary General of the Ministry of Romi. That's the Ministry for Public Housing, Spatial Planning, Environment and Infrastructure. And the reason we are here today is for the launch of the um, awareness song and slogan for the campaign for the cleanup and recycling for uh, 2020, which Vromi is obviously taking part in. And we have other partners taking part in as well. And today, you know, we've had the, the um, uh, how you say, the, the selection of the slogans. We've had a lot of participants in it, the slogans and the song. And um, the purpose here today is to have the launch and the announcement of um, those events. And um, I have the distinguished honor to invite the Minister of Romi, Minister Christopher Waver, to uh, you know, host the event and announce and give more information about the campaign as well. Good afternoon, and thank you for coming on a Saturday afternoon for this special occasion. Um, it's been a long road for us. I think as my first day in office, this was one of the first ideas I brought to the table with my cabinet. And we said, you know, we have to work it out because it's important to inform the community in order to make a change. But in order to make a change, we all need to be involved. And based on that as well, when we came across a slogan, we said, okay, we had some in the past, but we need to make sure that it connects with the community. So let's involve everybody and let's make sure, put the ad out in the paper and request people, the community, to come up with a slogan. So that way it becomes not mine, but St. Martin's own and it, it becomes real. And after 250 something applicants, you know, um, it was difficult. We came to a few and then um, eventually we, we chose and selected one slogan and it seems to everything just to fit fall in place. Um, so I'll first award the, the winner and then we'll talk a little bit about the campaign song as it pertains to that and how we got to that point. So um, I would like to now ask Ms. Uh, Lisa Freeman, who won the competition, to please step forward. Yes. We have a small token of appreciation. I know people are like, what do we win? What do we win? But it wasn't about the prize. It was more about the involvement in the community. But we thought it was, you know, only fair to give you something as well for you to, re to remember this occasion. So it says, thank you, Lisa Freeland, for your contribution to the 2020 Cleanup and Recycling Campaign. And the name of the slogan is, be part of the solution, reduce your pollution. So based on that, and also um, in your email that you send us, you also mentioned the brown, brown pelican and all that. So we did incorporate that in the logo as well. So, um, so there you have it. So this is going to be the logo and the slogan for the campaign that we're going to launch. We do have a few events coming up this year still, but in 2020, we're really looking to focus on the calendar. So like, just like how the SHTA has their calendar of events, we're going to have our calendar of events, but focus on mostly cleanup and campaigns and all the NGOs that are busy with beach cleaning and, and all that, that people know what's going to happen when, you know, so that way everybody's aware. So th this is a great start and appreciate it. And thank you so much. Thank you. I don't know if you want to say a few words well, on how you how came you to it. Yes. Well, my thing is that why I put like reduce your pollution is uh, because everybody kind of Everybody kind of thinks it's um, somebody else's problem. And my thing is to get rid of plastics, plastic bottles, plastic containers, 
because that's what you see all over the place, plastic bags. And uh, I think to make people aware, like it costs a lot more money to buy bottled water every day than if you have a filter on your, I mean, I drink tap water, but it, put a filter on your taps and, re, and reuse your uh, containers. And, um, but my thing pretty much was to make it like it's everybody's problem and not just, oh, well, they pay people to pick that up. They pay, you know, where, where those their garbage men are paid for. And that's what I hear. When I see people throw garbage out the window, I'm like, you know, what are you doing? And they're like, yeah, but somebody's paid to pick that up. You know what, your dollars are paying somebody where that money could go to something else. And it also just looks bad on the island when you have garbage everywhere. And it's mostly what you see are the bags and the, the, the food containers is what you see all over the place. And I think if you guys could get something going, like people bring their own containers for all this to-go food and, uh, you know, reusable bottles. I know we have a house full of re reusable bottles. And, um, you know, make people aware that it's not somebody else's problem. Anyway, thanks. <laughs> Thank you for that. And exactly what you mentioned, that's the whole idea of, and concept of this awareness program that we're, we're going to launch. It's more to get everybody involved, and it's not just a government problem, it's a everybody's problem. Yeah. And then, so when we got to that, we said, hey, but we need it to live. We need to give it life. So based on that, we said, okay, what can we do to give this now life? And one of the things was, we need a song, we need something so the community becomes aware of it and something that can carry it and give it some life. So based on that, once again, I sat down with the cabinet and we came and we talked about it and we said, hey, listen, it's a local thing. We need to have local artists involved in it. So one of the first calls I made then, I said um, to Diana, I said, contact first. <laughs> <laughs> if you contact first, all else will come in place. So that's exactly what I did. He came to the office and we had a good meeting. And pretty much I said, listen, we need to get some people together. Because it, it's not just, I don't want it to just be verse. I want other people involved as well. Different artists. We have so many talents on St. Martin. We need to expose them and be able to use and tap into that in order to make this live, you know, and to make it come alive. So based on that, we also have other ideas as well that's coming. So we have the campaign song. We're going to be working closely now to do a campaign video to market it. So to put it in the movie theaters as before the movie starts so people are aware, hey, I need to go put my popcorn. What I don't eat, the garbage, throw it away. So it's all those things to keep it going. So based on that, I would like to invite um, King Verse to the front and then to thank you so much for spearheading this. And um, I know it was a lot of back and forth as well as to, okay, this version, this version, and, and we finally got it right. You know, we're not gonna say how many versions, but we got it right, you know? And um, your dedication and everything, we really do appreciate it. And I want to, you to kind of tell us how you came about it and I know all we gave first was just a slogan and we said the rest you do. So based on that, he also uh, made sure the artist came on board and I would like to, for you to explain a little bit more about that and the artists that are featured in it. And then after that, we'll introduce the campaign's song as well. Thank you very much. Good evening now, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, first of all, it was an honor and I do thank you and I was very humbled when you, you know, placed the call. You said, hey, need you guys to come in, need you to come in and want to create this song around this slogan, et cetera. And I was like, okay, new challenge, challenge accepted. And uh, my first thought process was like, all right, who do I get? Who do I incorporate? I don't want to use always the same known artist, even though I use myself, I know, I know. But it's okay, it's, I'm the exception. But, uh, you know, so I um, thought about it and I said, all right, I want some new blood, of course. So I contacted uh, Kenyo Bali. You know, he's one of the young ones. Of course, uh, a new young phenom, I would call him, uh, D. Colors. He currently resides in Holland, a phenomenal writer, maybe like 19, 20 years old. And then, of course, I looked around and I was looking for an artist and I looked inside my own house, which I have a superstar who lives with me, and uh, my own stepdaughter, Tamilia Chance. And uh, she was actually on The Voice season three, France, 
finalists on The Voice season three. So, um, you know, just to plug that in there. So, um, you know, young, 15 years old. So I said, all right, we need her on the track as well. And I was one night trying to figure out, all right, how do I come up with a song? What am I going to do? Everybody thinks a jingle is easy. It's easier said than actually done. But I was vibing to different beats and so forth, and I came across, and it just hit me like a lightning bolt. You know what I mean? And uh, let's save the planet. We got to be part of the solution, reduce your pollution. We save St. Martin. You know, and uh, that's basically how it is. I contacted the producer, Omari Ferrari, and then uh, he, within a matter of days, gave me a beat, and I contacted everybody. Everybody was on board. We nailed it, went to the studio. As you said, you know, we had different versions. We had to tweak it here and there, which was all good. Uh, you know, got a big ups Diana over there. She was always, okay, check this and do this. You know what I mean? It was, it was a pleasure working with you guys. It was really smooth sailing and honored. And uh, congratulations to the winner for the slogan. The slogan sticks. I mean, I hope that we did it justice within the song as well when you guys hear it. And I do hope and look forward to this making a grand impact now and for years to come on St. Martin, because we do need to reduce the pollution, else we are going to be laying, uh, the, the dumpers might grow 10 times, and we don't want that for sure. So uh, I want to thank you guys again from the bottom of my heart. It's a great pleasure to be part of this project. Thank you very much. This is campaign song. Save St. Martin, save St. Martin. Save St. Martin, save St. Martin. Be part of the solution Let me do it. Reduce hey. your pollution Save the planet Save the planet hey. Be part of the solution Reduce your pollution And save the planet Save the planet Let's all get together and save this Be place Be part you know of me? the solution what? What? Reduce your pollution hey. And save the Yo. planet Need everyone to lend a hand quick hey. Stand together and save the planet We can do it, pick it up and trash it Band together and ban the plastic Preserve the earth for the next generation Take care of your surroundings, reduce your pollution One love, one people, one fusion All together, we are the solution Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Save ourselves from destroying us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Save ourselves from destroying us Need every helping hand to save St. Martin Save the planet Be part of the solution Reduce the pollution Save St. Martin Save the planet be part of the solution yeah. Reduce your pollution okay. And save the planet Let's save our planet Let us make things better Pollution's all around us But all we need is effort If you spend less time on your phone yeah, Look around you, everything is going wrong All we gotta do is wake up And clean our environment up hey. Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Save ourselves from destroying us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us. Wake up, wake up, it's up to us. Wake up, wake up, it's up to us. Save ourselves from destroying us. Need every helping hand to save St. Martin. Save the planet. Be a part of the solution. Reduce your pollution. Save St. Martin. Save the planet. Be a part of the solution. Reduce your pollution and save the planet. Save the planet. No, there's no need to panic We can all do this together If we all lend a helping hand Pick up the trash And put it in the bag Simple life can make a difference in life forever Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us, up to us. Save ourselves from destroying us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Save ourselves from destroying us Need every helping hand to save St. Martin Save the planet Be part of the solution Reduce your pollution Save St. Martin Save the planet Be part of the solution Reduce your pollution and save the planet so When I take a trip around my country Wanna keep it clean, keep it looking healthy When you wanna throw your garbage out Better find a trash can and park it up Still it's a rain and a ding 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 When you go to the beach for a swim 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 The 
pick up your trash for you leave, 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 leave I shouldn't even have to say please hey. Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to it's us, up to us. Save, Save ourselves from destroying us huh. Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Wake up, wake up, it's up to us Save ourselves from destroying us Need every help in hand Save St. Martin Save the planet Be a part of the solution Reduce your pollution And save St. Martin Save the planet Be a part of the solution Reduce your pollution And save the planet Save the planet Be a part of the solution Reduce your pollution you already know, this message is brought to you by the Ministry of Romy. Remember, be part of the solution. Reduce your pollution. Um, so as you see, it's very catchy, you know, and it's going to be playing on the radios. It's gonna, we're going to really promote it and get awareness out there. And there's a lot of events that we're going to be planning. So stay tuned for that. I'm actually happy that um, the Member of Parliament, Brown, uh, Chanel Brown Bell, is here today as chairperson of the Romi Committee in Parliament. So there'll be a lot of collaboration there as well as to what we can do pertaining to our laws and to uh, you know, policies from that end and how we could all tie up together and to make things move. So um, thank you guys for coming out tonight and thanks everybody for their contribution because without you, we couldn't have done it. Op donderdag 9 januari 2020 vinden onze parlementsverkiezingen plaats. De stembureaus zullen geopend zijn van 8 uur s ochtends tot en met 8 uur s avonds. Bij het betreden van het stembureau dient u zich eerst te registreren. Kiesgerechtigden dienen hun stemkaart en een geldig identiteitsbewijs mee te nemen. Dit betekent een geldig paspoort, rijbewijs of identiteitskaart. Na de verificatie ontvangt u van de voorzitter uw stembiljet. U begeeft zich direct naar het stemhokje dat leeg is. U brengt uw stem uit door de witte cirkel voor de naam van de kandidaat van uw keuze te kleuren met het rode potlood. Gebruik alleen het rode potlood. Stem op één kandidaat, schrijf en teken niet op het stembiljet. Indien u een fout heeft gemaakt, krijgt u van de voorzitter eenmalig nieuw stembiljet. Het is verboden om uw stem te verkopen, gebruik te maken van een mobiele telefoon en foto's of video's te maken. Nadat u uw stem heeft uitgebracht, vouwt u het stembiljet op en doet u dit in de stembus. Maak gebruik van uw stemrecht. Gaat u stemmen!